Hi, it's Matt here for NewsShooter.com at IBC Amsterdam 2015. I'm with Mark from G Technology. So what have you got that's new for the show? We've got a handful of items. Um, starting with our Studio XL, which is actually a current product, but we have a new version of it. It's an eight, normally, or up until now, has been an eight bay uh, Thunderbolt 2 RAID with tremendous performance. What we've done is we've brought it into our, our Evolution Series ecosystem. So we have these EV bay adapters down at the bottom. Wait, make sure I feel them. Uh, our EV bay adapters here. So you can take our, our Evolution Series modules and, and stick them in uh, so you can offload directly to your RAID or you can do other things like use our new Evolution Series uh, red card reader uh, for red mini mags. To so it's basically sort of a, a, a hot swappable system so you can take things and use them. You know, you might have an EV dock somewhere, but you may have right. one of these back in the office so you can just swap between them. Absolutely. So you can swap between them, have very fast storage that you can copy onto, or on set if you want to use this, you could, again, take your reader, pop it in one slot, make a very fast copy onto the main RAID storage that you would keep on set, and then separately also copy to an EV220 as a shuttle drive to send back to, to post. Fantastic. And what else have we got here that's new? Well, so the, I did mention the the reader for the RAID Mini Mag. Like our, like our Evolution Series modules, it allows you to bus power on USB 3, so it works as a standalone reader, or it gives you that Thunderbolt connectivity that RAID doesn't have on their readers. Uh, whether it's in the G Dock or whether it's in the Studio XL or even in our ATC cases um, with Thunderbolt. Then next we have our G Dock EV Solo. And this is a single bay USB 3 dock. Uh, so you now have connectivity on machines that don't have Thunderbolt, as well as giving you a, a, a single dock with a more attractive price point. So it's $99 US is the MSRP. Um, so it's very, very affordable. And now what's what's the benefits of using this than say just having the drive and plugging it in directly via USB 3? Uh, well, first of all, it makes things simpler. Um, it gives you a cleaner work uh, workstation, and especially if you're in a, a multi or sorry a, a multi workstation environment, you can have these connected, and, simp and and it makes the process very simple. You don't have to look for cables, connect. Um, especially if your, uh, let's say your, your tower is behind the desk somewhere, you don't have to go struggling to find where to plug in. But at the same time, it also gives you a uh, powered connection if you don't want to bus power. And our EV220, for example, can be bus powered, but it takes two connections. So this doesn't require that. It's just a simple plug and play and go. Fantastic. Yeah. And, and then you've got one more thing here. One more little doohickey. Um, it are, is our, ev our Evolution Series FireWire 800 adapter. Uh, there are many people out there still using FireWire 800, um, whether it's audio and or video, um, and especially even for things like audio recorders on set. I can plug this into any of my EV Series modules and bus power the same way as on the others, even daisy chain as I have two ports. Uh, so I can use this on set. I can plug into my extra, my audio recorder that has FireWire 100 out, bus power the drive, pull the drive off, pop it in, use it with the rest of the ecosystem right okay. away. Now I believe this one here is going to be shipping for $99. Correct. And how much is this, this little is one going to be? currently shipping for $49. Uh, and then the Studio XL, it varies. We start at $27.99 for the 18 terabyte version with two bay adapters. Um, $29.99 for the 24 terabyte version with two bay adapters, and it goes up to uh, just under $49.99 uh, for the 48 terabyte version. That's six, eight terabyte drives inside. Thanks, Mark. You got it. Thank you.